Hi, uh, this is Vance Johnson here. Um, what I'm about to do, I'm, I, I don't recall myself doing ever on Facebook or um, live media stream or on recorded stream. Um, however, uh, it's been on my heart to do it. And mostly because it's, it's uh, life has been great and I have no complaints and um, you know, uh, I've got things to do right now and, and um, uh, according to my business, with my business, however, um, I've been interrupted um, from yesterday, mind-wise, on uh, taking this approach. And um, I've been wondering how to do it, you know, but, you know, I'm just going to do it and just leave this that because, you know, for far too long, I, I know who I am. And um, uh, for far too long, I have been, you know, I would say disobedient to the Heavenly Father and things that he wants me to do. Um, I'm still doing my best not to be a pastor. Um, I rather would just be a motivational speaker or just speak to somebody or encourage them. Um, because I know uh, the, the uh, responsibilities that are there um, for these type of people. And the ridicules and stuff like that, you know, that they go through. I mean, I get it, and I'm not even on that level, you know. And I have people inboxing me and saying stuff to me that uh, they um, <laughs> would not dare come to me in front of my face and say, you know, because they know that I am the bless you type of person. I bless you so you don't do it again. Um, that being said, uh, the Bahamas right now is going through uh, a very, very change. Um, and very important part of its life, its uh, 40, 40 some year period of life. Um, the Bahamas, I'm 50 years old and uh, the Bahamas uh, didn't get independence until 73. So we're looking at, um, you know, that's 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73. You're looking at approximately uh, 46, 40, you know, 44 years old, you know, as a country. Um, that means we're still young. We're still young. We're still a young nation, and and you know we're barely over one generation, which is forty years. So there's a lot of mistakes that um, we have done in the past, and um, there's a lot of mistakes that we could go, you know, do again in the future. Um, but we don't have to go through those mistakes. Um, I've got stories about about my life where, um, and I'll get to them, you know, in different videos and stuff like that. I've spoken about it. But I'll do videos on it, you know, where uh, my parents or grandparents or mom or dad gave me, uh, told me certain things and um, told me to do them. And, and uh, uh, I didn't do them. And, um, you know, there were repercussions. Um, but there's one. There's one thing that I want to do. Because I don't want to feel. I don't want to say that I had the chance to say it and I never said it and if something happens then I feel responsible for it. Um, so this is what I'm going to say. This is the, I, I want I want to read something to you guys. Okay. It's out of Psalms thirty three. Rejoice in the Lord, O ye righteous, for praise is com com comely for the upright. Praise the Lord with harp. Sing unto him with psaltery and, and, and instruments of ten strings. Sing unto him a new song. Play skillfully with a loud noise. For the word of the Lord is right, and all his works are done in truth. He loveth the righteous and judgment. He loveth righteousness and judgment. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. By the way... By the word of the Lord were the heavens made, and all the host of them by the breath of his mouth. He gathered the waters of the sea together as a heap. He laid upon the depth in storehouse. Let all the earth fear the Lord. Let all the inhabitants of the world stand in awe of him. For he spake, and it was done 
he commanded, and it stood fast. The Lord bringeth the counsel of the heathen to naught. He maketh the device of the people of non-effect. Let me read that again. The Lord bringeth the counsel of the heathen, heathen to naught. He maketh the devices of the people of non-effect. The counsel of the Lord standeth forever. The thoughts of his heart to all generations. Blessed is the nation, Bahamas. Blessed is the nation, Bahamas. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. And the people, the Bahamians, the people, the Bahamians, who had chosen for his own inheritance. The Lord spoketh from heaven, he beholded all the sons of men. From the place of, of from the place of his habitation, he looketh upon all the inhabitants of the earth, including the Bahamians and the Bahamas. He fashioned their hearts alike. He considered all their works. There is no king, no prime minister, no no pastor, save by the multitude of an, of an host. A mighty man is not delivered by much strength. A horse is a vain thing for safety. Neither shall he deliver any by his great strength. Behold, the eye of the Lord is upon them that fear him. Behold, the eye of the Lord is upon them that fear him, upon them that hope in his mercy, to deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in famine. To deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in famine. Our soul waited for the Lord. He is our help and our shield. For our heart shall rejoice in him. Because we, Bahamians, have trust in his holy name. Let the mercy of Lord, of our O Lord, let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us according as we hope in thee. Now, when I said prime minister, pastors, and leaders, I'm not talking about our, our prime minister, Perry Christie. I'm talking about anybody that wants to be prime minister of the Bahamas. You're not that big. Okay? So maybe Branville, maybe Minnis, maybe Mr. Christie staying in power. This message right here is to let you know y'all ain't that big. That's one. Okay? Two. Okay? Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord and the people whom he had chosen for his own inheritance. I know the Bahamas as a Christian nation. The only thing that we used to do was have our little junk canoe. But you know what? That right there was a seed planted 50 years ago because before junk canoe, we didn't even have that. Okay, so now every weekend we frolic and we frolic and we frolic and we having parties, we having parties, we have having parties. Is our God still Jehovah God? The average person in the Bahamas right now has been to more socializing events that include partying and drinking, and sexing, and texting, and cussing, and fighting, than they've been to church. The Bahamas has been partying from January 1st. The average person that I've spoken to that, go, that, 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 that I know go to church in the Bahamas, every time you call them, have you been to church? No. You been to the rally? Yeah. Oh, going to carnival, going to party. Now these are people, okay, that 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 supposed to be God fearing. Okay, it's just just not one person, not two person. I'm not passing judgment or anything because guess what, me? Okay, I don't have a church home. Okay, so I get online and I and I uh, either listen to them on table, listen to BFM. Okay, listen to people that's gonna inspire me and 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 and, and you know give me the word. Okay. Uh, to tell you the truth, 
I've been listening to more Pastor Miles Monroe, and I, I, I must say that, that, that I beg God forgiveness for even uh, uh, leaving the Bahamas so soon, okay, that I didn't get all the teaching, but at least Pastor Miles left it for us, okay, by videos and books so that we can read them, because guess what? There's so much that I've, I've been learning in the last couple of months, just, just getting my mind together. I don't know why I'm doing this. Because I have businesses upon businesses and ideas upon ideas to keep going and going and going and going because it's not for me. It's not for me. I'm not doing anything for me. And that's why I'm doing this video. I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing this for my royals. You know why? Because guess what? At the end of the day, at the end of the day, it's for my children and your children. Okay? So that being said, something was laid on my heart this morning to share with you. Why don't we just go on a fast? Go on a three-day fast. You can start at 6 o'clock today, end it Tuesday, 6 o'clock on Saturday. I mean, 6 o'clock today, you end it Monday, 6 o'clock tomorrow, ends on Tuesday. And let's vote according to morals. Okay? There are three things in life. The good, the bad, the ugly. You got the good in the F and M. You got the, the ugly in the F and M. You got the bad in the F and M. You got the good in the PLP. You got the bad in, in, in the PLP. And you got the ugly, very ugly in the PLP. You got the good in the in, in, in the DNA. You got the bad in the DNA. And you got the very some ugly in the DNA. Okay? So why don't we just pray and fast? So that we can get more good out of those three parties into the house of assembly than the bad and the ugly. Okay? You know, vote on morals. Okay? Ask your candidate. Okay? Are you into homes? Are you into a uh, uh, same-sex marriage? Okay? Are you into homosexuality? Okay? Uh, uh, how many people you as a lawyer or as a businessman have crooked? How many things have you done for the community? Like I spoke to somebody um, uh, uh, Three days ago, I called because I wanted to do some business back home. And um, you know what the person told me? They said, Vance, you have not changed one bit. You, from, from, from I know you, every time you talk about business, you talk about empowering someone else. You talk about the growth of people. And that's, what, that's, that's why I open a business. I don't open a business to get rich. Okay, to tell you the truth, I am rich. Why? And that's why I'm still working. Only rich people work. Wealthy people don't work. I pray to God one day I get I, 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 I get on the level of wealth. That way I don't have to work the way I have to work and, and, and stress my mind all the time. Okay, but I told him, you know, because we were having a conversation and, and he was like, you know, basically, when you have a company, that company is not to make you rich. That company is to make the community rich. Okay, that company is to make sure that little Bobby goes to private school because Joey's working for you and his wife is working for your brother. Okay, alrighty. And when 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 the uh, uh, the wife or the, the the husband decides to open up a business, uh, they have enough money saved and they can come to you and you can empower them. That's what we're supposed to do. So when I'm going online and I'm 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 hearing uh, my not my best friend but one of my friends, my school friends. Uh, uh, her, you know, they're, they're having to be thrown out of their store on Bay Street. These are people, let me show you something. I grew up in a straw market. Okay, yes, yes. Um, uh, my, my earthly father is of prominence. My earthly mother is of prominence. However, I thank God for my grandmother that showed me and taught me how to work hard. Okay, I grew up in a straw market. And let me tell you something. Okay, you got the Franklin Wilsons and you got the Light Bonds. Those are straw market people. Okay, that's the product that we produce, that the, the straw market has produced. And there's plenty of people in, out of the straw market that had stores on Bay Street. And for you guys to kick them off of Bay Street, that's well, where do you want us to be? Okay, how are you empowering the people? All right, the only way that I can open up, the only way that I can. Uh, 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 Open up a business in, in, in the United States of America, okay, is if I have enough money to purchase the buildings, okay, and I have citizenship, okay, and I hire Americans. 
How am I going to go and come to the Bahamas as a Jamaican or a Haitian or a Chinese or, or an Israeli and kick somebody off a of Bay Street and only hire Israelis, Jamaicans, Haitians, or Chinese? How? Where is that? And all of this is happening because we are no longer, we are drifting away from God. Okay? Um... We don't get up in the morning and pray anymore. We give commands. God bless me. God bless me. God bless me. God bless me. You know, we, we barely say, Father God, I thank you, and uh, I uh, uh, you know, I thank you for I thank you for waking me up this morning, and um, I pray that your will be done in my life. We we, we barely do that. We barely pray for for for, for Miss Hannah or Miss Allen or, or Miss McKinsey or Miss Munka. Okay, what about our neighbors? Already, do you know that when you say build a hedge of protection around your household, you should ask to build a hedge of protection around your corner, so that Miss Allen child could be just as protected as Mr. Mr. Johnson child, so that Miss 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 McKenzie's son could get a job just as much as Miss Camp's son, so that Mr. Munker, uh, uh children could be uh, uh, happy just as much as 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 as, as Mr. Thompson them children. Okay. That's what we're that, that's what we're missing. So please, folks, if you got just just you know, I'm not I, I don't know I'm, I ain't no prophet, but the only thing that I'm going to tell you is this: this election is going to affect the Bahamas two ways, two, two. Either we're going to end up like Haiti, Jamaica, Syria. Nicaragua or Cuba? Or are we gonna end up like Dubai? And the reason why I mention those countries, because those countries, before they were poor, they were rich off of their natural resources. And they allowed foreigners to come into their country and rape their country dry. Okay? And there were leaders, not white leaders, there were the black leaders that allowed them to come in. So let's get off of that racial stuff. Okay, let's get off of that. Alrighty, there was our own that allowed those people to come in and rape those countries so that those people would be poor. Okay, we got Argonite, we got, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do you know why tourism hasn't dropped in the Bahamas even with the murder? Because we're only 60 miles away from America. We're still the cheapest destination to travel in the world. And everybody in America who has not been on a plane, when they want to leave, it is cheaper to come to us. So guess what? With, 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 over six, with, with over 3 billion people in America, and only a billion of them has traveled, every time someone gets their passport, it costs them $120, $150 to come to the Bahamas. We don't want that blessing to stop. That's, a, that's an automatic blessing. Okay? But then when we sell our water, like how we did again, how we tried to do again with long line fishing and all these stuff, then we're going to lose again. Okay? Alrighty? We got Argonite. Okay? Uh, 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 I don't want to get into it because it's personal. However, Bahamians, you guys can do that too. Don't just, don't just go and say that the, 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 the uh, 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 Bahamian government is letting the Chinese do it. You can do it also. The reason why... All the government parties are getting in with stuff is because of us. We are allowing it, okay? We are sitting on our butts, okay, and not being creative, all righty, and, 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 and just going ahead and just doing stuff. How, okay, okay, okay. All right, you know what? You know what? I'll tell you it. Who's to say you can't go and get a 40-foot container right now, okay, Tell a couple boys, pay them $50 or whatever, or you do it yourself weekly, okay? Load up a container of conch shell, alrighty? Make a trip to China, make your deal to Pakistan, and get the raw material for Argonite. You could do it! So don't just sit down and say the Bahamian government costing you not to do it. Okay? You could do it! But because we are so blinded, we're not God-faring anymore. We're too busy frolicking, we're too busy partying because we're always drunk we're always drunk we can't think 
And we don't realize that we freaking broke until the next morning when we wake up. Yes, I did say that. Like I said, I, I'm not perfect. And I, I keep trying to tell you all that. The only thing that I know that I'm never going to do is call nobody an N-word or flip no bird or tell no one to kiss my hip. Okay? But I'm just telling you guys, please, Bahamians. Okay? It, whoever watching this video, when is the last time you paid, you paid proper duty? Okay, I was so, so, so proud of a friend a couple of months ago when I was doing some business in the Bahamas. Uh, they said, you know what? This is the taxes that's supposed to pay on back and we're going to pay it because you all were saying that we need to do this and we need to be do it done right. Okay, and sitting down and having conversations on how the Bay Street Boys schemes the Bahamas government every month. The, the 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 ones with American citizenship coming through on, 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 on the U.S. side of the line so that they don't pay duty because we have some stupid law that Americans don't pay taxes. Look, I live in America, okay? Alrighty? When my people come to America, they pay tax. When they leave, they pay tax. Alrighty? Honest people don't mind doing honest things. Alrighty? So the Americans don't mind paying taxes. Let them pay their tax. And then you, leaders of the Bahamas, okay, I'm not talking about Perry Christie. I'm not talking about Branville McCartney. I'm not talking about, 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 about uh, 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 Doc Minnis. I'm talking about the people. Keep your hand on the cookie jar. Okay? When, the, when, when, when people come to the password office, and they charge and you charge them thirty dollars. Don't say thirty dollars if you if you if 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 if, if, if uh, you give me lunch, I can get it for you quicker. Okay. When they go to the to, to, to the traffic office to pay their their, their for, for their licensing, okay, let them pay the correct price. That's why I don't. I, that's why I don't even think that you guys should be able to accepting cash anymore in the Bahamas. Everything should be credit card. Why? So that the people can be honest. Because half of this money that's missing out of the Bahamas is the natives that have taken the money. Okay, like I was in a meeting a couple of years ago, over 25 years ago in the Bahamas. The lady goes, she says, she says, one thing with y'all Bahamians, y'all think it's y'all God-given right to teach. And I remember I told a friend one time, I said, uh, we'll take Jesus off the cross if, if he gives us a chance. So again, please, don't, 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 don't blame the government. Blame us. Okay? And get back on, 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 on the message. Let's return to God. Let's return to God. Let's start praying. Let's pass for our nation. Because like I said, we only go in two ways. We only go in two ways. Okay? We go in left. We go in right. And at the end of the day, I won't go right. Okay? Because right is north. Right is north. Alrighty? And that's where God is. Alrighty? That's where God is. God don't move. Every place, every part of the compass move. Every part of the compass move, but God don't move. You could go northwest, north, south, north. But guess what? They move. But you know what? North stay right there. Alright? North stay right there. They don't move. Okay? And that's where we need to be. So... Those of you that were able to stay to the end of this video, let's do this right now. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us of all of our trespasses, as we forgive those that trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Amen, guys. Okay, um, let's have a safe weekend. Let's have a uh, prosperous um, new year, because after May 10th, it's going to be a new year and a new life for the Bahamas. Um, may all the candidates um, be... All the candidates that need to win, may they win. Um, and may the country goes in the correct direction that it needs to go in. 
And uh, it doesn't take changing the government to have the country go in the correct way, changing some people, but it don't have to change the government. Take care.